What is going on everybody? TD Presents here and I'm back with some Mutt 25. We are currently heading into our divisional round playoff game after an undefeated regular season. It is Super Bowl or bust after going undefeated last year and losing in the Super Bowl. So this game we do have to win it but at the same time it doesn't mean that much. If we go on to lose this game this season will be a complete failure. You can see my opponent, he is running the triple option. He gets some good yardage on it the first time, but in the second time, we bring him down in the backfield. Now second and 13, he looks left side. He's going to find his receiver, and he is going to be just short of a first down. Now Robert Griffin back to pass, scrambles right side, makes Mario Williams miss, but Chandler Jones is there to bring him down. And on second and 16, he's going five wide, and look who it is once again, Chandler Jones. That's going to make it 3rd and 26. And in the very next play, Vontae Davis comes up with the interception. And no one is even going to touch him. He scores the touchdown and we take a 7-0 lead. 1st and 10, he's going back to the read option. And look who is there to force the fumble, Joe Hayden. He didn't do much for me in the regular season. Chandler Jones comes up with the fumble recovery. And eventually, we punch it in with Walter Payton. And we take a 14-0 lead. My opponent shows he can move the ball. Here, looks, finds Michael Irving. Makes two guys miss. Chandler Jones is somehow down the field to bring him down. Heck of a game by Chandler Jones so far. And now we skip ahead. He is in the red zone. He hands this one off to Adrian Peterson. But he doesn't go nowhere. So on third and five, we hit the two-minute warning. RG3 scrambling out, rolling out. And look who it is, Vontae Davis once again. Chandler Jones and Vontae Davis are having a heck of a game. And with a minute 54 left, look how off he is of Demarius Thomas. So I change him from a streak to a comeback route. And he completely burns the cornerback. And the Tom Brady and Demarius Thomas connection continues throughout the playoffs. And we now go up three scores. My opponent has a minute 40 to work with. He finds his receiver, Michael Irving. He's going to pick up a first down and much more. Now there's a minute 25 left. Going five wide. Runs a little wide receiver screen. He gets it out to Kelvin Johnson Jr. And he keeps the chains moving once again. But now he's faced with a third and two. RG3 rolling right side. He's looking. He's trying to scramble back to the middle. He's going back right. And he's eventually going to get brought down by Vince Wilfork. And that's going to make it fourth and 12. This would be a huge stop if we can get it here. RG3 back to pass. And who else but Vontae Davis comes up with his third interception. He completes the hat trick. And my opponent would go on to quit the game. And since this video was so short and I didn't get a chance to play my conference championship, which will be on Mutthead TV tomorrow, I decided to go ahead and open up about 75,000 worth of packs. I usually don't have any luck in these packs, but then again, I really don't open them that much to begin with. So in this first pack, you can see we really don't get much. Gold card only 74 overall. We did get a Michael Vick, sold him for about three or 4,000. So I guess it definitely wasn't the worst pack in the world. So we're gonna go ahead, open a new one. Nothing so far. And once again, our gold player worth about 500 coins. Really wasn't anything in that pack at all. No silvers. I mean, there's a decent amount of silver players out there right now that are worth a good amount, but we didn't even get any of those in that pack. So maybe this third pack would be better. Arthur Brown, he's not worth anything. We get a Golden Tate. He's not worth much. Definitely a great wide receiver. If you're looking for a strong receiver or you're running a budget squad, Golden Tate, definitely your man. Runs for about 3,000. He's got good speed, good catching, good strength. In the next pack, we get a Percy Harvin. Sold him for about 8,000 coins. Another fantasy card. Definitely an abundance of them on the auction house, so he's not really worth much. And then look at this. I get a Champ Bailey, and I was thinking to myself, why can't I get a Champ Bailey collectible? And the next card was a Champ Bailey collectible. That's probably going to be the highlight of this pack opening. I don't know. We'll see. It's hard to beat a pack where you get 25,000. In a collectible, you get a fantasy card. And Brandon Merriweather sold him for about five or 6000 And we're going to keep opening these packs. You can see, once again, another low gold player. I've gotten a couple of collectibles before. I know this left tackle for the Giants sells for about 10000 
so that pack was a complete waste. But then we get a Darius Hayward bang. I'm not really looking for too much value in these packs, but I've never really pulled a really good player. The best pack, the best players I've ever pulled are the Malcolm Smith you guys see me get. You guys just saw me get a Percy Harvin. I've never gotten anyone better than that, so I'm hoping maybe we can get a legend. But we get another Malcolm Smith. I don't know. These packs aren't that good. Will Allen, he's a silver. doesn't go for anything. So we get two packs remaining. In this pack right here, we get another fantasy player. Goes for about 2,000 coins, if that. Once again, great budget squad player, but we really don't get anything. So I decided to go ahead and open up some jumbo coin packs. And I actually got a 10,000 one to start it off. So I was pretty happy about that. I opened the second one, and I got another 10,000 one. So... You guys are going to see me open up a third one. Definitely not nearly as good as the first two where I got about 15,000. But these coin packs kind of made me feel a little bit better about the brutal pack opening we just had. I was kind of hoping to pull an Ed Reed, but hey, it is what it is. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'm out.